First up for us came a run around the rugged temple perimeter, hauling 50-pound urns along the way. To prove we could withstand the pain of old-school Bokachula training, the Grand Master had us shin-kick bamboo shafts and slam our elbows into coconuts. The main focus in Bokator conditioning is using your body as a weapon against objects that are harder than your body. That conditions you not only to deliver punishment, but to absorb it and keep moving forward. And the conditioning was just a warm-up. Next, we worked with the Dombong Vang staff to prove our reflexes and coordination were up to snuff. And we tossed 20-pound pots and shattered hardened clay vessels with our knuckles and elbows. See how this kind of natural training really forged the Khmer warrior because you had to be super tough. When you use things in the environment like trees, coconuts, even clay pots, you can get cut. It really toughens you up.